I experience micromanaging as very different than parenting because mm. a parent will do something for their child quite often, not expecting anything in return. It is mm. like the most, I think, <laughs> even though we hate it, like it's quite often like the pure er act of service because this person needs me. So I'm doing these things for them out of like pure love. Whereas micromanaging, it is the realm of control. It is like, I don't trust you to do this. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to handle this. And, you know, <clears throat> it's interesting when we think about acts of service, I'm thinking about how much you said, make my partner's life easier. And I think that's beautiful. And we have to, <clears throat> to the point that you just made, really check our intentions. Because to me, when something is out of the realm of love, I am loving you and genuinely, I don't need anything back from you. Mm -hmm. That's when it's love. If I'm expecting something back from you because I do this thing, that's when we shift into the realm of transaction. And when we're in the realm of transaction, I will feel some kind of way if I don't get that thing reciprocated back on the other end. And that's not clear. It's like, you know, that's a little bit manipulative. And of course we all do it, but we can name the thing. And that's why we're doing the thing that we're doing. We're attempting to manipulate the situation and we're not being clear with the other person and our intentions underneath why we're doing this loving thing. 